Hi, my name is Mary and my job is to buy books in used conditions. I will buy on Amazon and sell profitably on Amazon as well. So what I'm going to do now is that I will show you some examples on how I gathered some data points that I have analyzed on this book in order to make a good buying decision. Now let's start with the type of the book. This is a cookbook and the first thing that I need to analyze is the buy box of a such good book and of course in used condition and currently the used buy box price is at $27 so I could buy this for $5 and actually I have already found it in AB. So this is $5 and I can see a potential here for a good profit. However, I really need to check some data points before I will decide to purchase this book. So for data analysis, I have here the Kipa chart where I can use it to research price, rank history, as well as Amazon selling activity. So the first point that I need to analyze is the average price. So, and you can see this uh, brown triangles. So I can see that on Amazon, the book never goes below $6. And usually it's around $6.50. So, it means that if we buy $5, we can get a great deal. So, it's a pass for me since it's below the average. The second point that I need to analyze is the demand graph. In this graph, I am trying to find out how fast this book sell. So, every drops that you can see here it will count as one sales and the spike that you see at the periods is without sales actually keepa says about 39 drops per month and every drop is a sale but since data is not that accurate i estimate around 40 to 60 sales every month in this book which is a great amount of sales because if you get the buy box which is the 27 dollars uh, basically there will be two sales every day and for that one uh, if also if you will get the buy box you have the best chance of selling out. Now the third and the last point to analyze is the seller graph in the black line. It will show how many used sellers. So now for the sellers, I am looking at the amount of sellers versus the demand. We already know that this book sells around 40 to 60 sales times per month. And this seller graph shows that there are 76 used sellers, which means that in two months' time, if no new seller joins, the stock is basically dried up, and that means that the price can go up because the demand outweighs the supply. So it's best if we will buy it now while there is still stock, and the price is not that high okay so therefore as you can see many data points need to check first before making decision what i do i just combine the data together to see if there is a risk in this case no risk identified so i can go ahead and buy this book so what you can see, my job is combining multiple and historical data points to be able to have a great buying decision.